We need to evaluate this. Everything is on the base of four. Good. What you need to do now is to bring them back together. Hope you look at the laws of logarity. If you have not checked it, go back. Otherwise, you will enjoy this class. Check it in this channel. They need to come back together because where they are now, it was argument, quarry that made them to be separated. That is why we have plus, minus. For them to come together as a family, we take one of the base. This means times. So when this and this are coming together, we put times. Because of this minus, when this one will join them, we put divide by two. Okay? That is the first step. You agree with me, two year is one, two year is four. Okay? So we can say now, log four multiplied by 32 to the base of four. Okay? So I already know that if I do this 32, four into 32, I'm going to have Eight. 4 into this is 2, 2 into this is 1. So, this simply means 4 times 4 times 2. You can express it as this is 4 raised to power 3 multiplied by 2. I still want to keep this 4. What I'm going to do next now, I separate them again because I saw 4 here. This is too stubborn. Without 4, for me, it's stubborn. I need to quickly separate them to make the work easy for me. I put three here. Because of these times, I put plus here again. I take this four. I put this two here. So this is not separated from this using this plus. Okay? You agree with me? If you have something like this, this need to leave here. Come to this place. Now, what is this? This is one. So this is equals to three times one, which is three plus log to the base of 4. What is the meaning of this in terms of 4? It means the square root of 4. It's still 2. I've not changed anything. If I put 2 here, same. If there is no 2 here, I put square root of 4, still the same thing. Because of this 4, I'm looking for something 4, something 4, something 4, something 4, to have it be 1. What is the meaning of this square root? It means 1 over 2, raised to power 1 over 2. I will remove this from here and I put 1 over 2 here. This is still 1 now. This is now 1. Therefore, I have this. 1 multiplied by this is 1 over 2. You agree with me? If you solve this now, you're going to have 6 plus 1, which is 7 over 2. 